We often get asked about what to do when your chilli seedlings get too spindly, like these ones here, or, in a worst case scenario, like these ones here. Seedlings get etiolated because they are either too crowded, like in this case, or they haven't got enough light. And what happens is plants need light, especially chilies, which are sun-loving tropical plants, and the cells in the stem get you can't produce more cells, so they, the cells get individually get bigger, reaching out, trying to make the plant taller so that they can find the light. Now what you have to do is plant them deep, right up to the cotyledons, like these. Now these are cotyledons, they're not true leaves. This is, that is the first true leaf there. Okay, to prick out your chilli seedling, first of all you need a pot full of compost, multi-purpose compost, and keep it loose. Do not be tempted to compress it. Make a deep hole, as deep as you can, especially if the chilli seedling is etiolated, like that. Then get your seedling. Now, always hold it by the leaves or the cotyledons, never the stem, because you could damage that. And then just gently ease it in, all the way down. All the way down so that the cotyledons are just above the compost. And then carefully bring it in. Don't be tempted to push. All that is likely to do is to compress the compost and damage the stem. You get contact roots with the compost by watering like that. Really soak it. And there you are. One healthy chili plant, which would have been etiolated and weakened if you hadn't planted it deep. Now, what do you do if your seedling looks a bit like this? If you put it into the pot, even all the way down, it's still going to be tall and a little bit gangly. So, what you do, drop it in and literally push that stem down a little bit further like that. And then put the compost in. Ease the stem down a bit, then bring it into the centre so it gets a little bit deeper. There. There we are. See, the cotyledons now are just above the compost. Wet it down. Do not compress it. Wet it down. And there you are. One lit plant which would have been much too tall and very sickly is now going to be a healthy chili plant.